a very, very warm welcome to all my fellow hairdressers, L'Oreal Pro Artist and the artist in making. Let me first of all say, wishing you a very, very happy new year. And welcome to the first ever Color Trend Masterclass of 2021 with me. As you all know, L'Oreal Professional, as a brand, we bring fashion to your salon floor. Last few years, you have seen the trend collection to be in brown families. Naming a few, My Mocha, Parisian Chocola, or even Parisian Cool. If I talk about the shade this year, I will only call it as hot. Garam nahi, hot. So let's dedicate 2021 color trend to be gold, vibrant, sophisticated, yet extremely versatile. It can be done for all your consumers. Red Sherry is the trend. You must be wondering, what exactly is Red Sherry? Sherry, in French, means love. So our hair color trend this season is going to be red love. So we have some amazing models to showcase in front of you today, including the color techniques, the placement of color, and the shade palette. For all the gorgeous red colors you will be doing on your clients on the salon floor. Also, very, very important is how to do the most perfect consultation for your consumers. But that's not all. Your styling is getting much, much more edgier and fun. We have a lot of new launches this year. We will be showcasing that too. So guys, stay tuned. So I'm using 30 volume because you know magic contrast, the mixing ratio is one is to one and a half. So I'm gonna take 75 ml of 30 volume and a full tube of magic contrast rouge or you call it as red too. And now I'm gonna start mixing it. Remember, the mixing has to be proper. You need to have a beautiful cream. The oxidant as well as your colorant should be mixed in really well. Always try mixing the product with a whisker and not use a brush. If you're using a brush while mixing, don't do the application with the same brush. Otherwise, there's gonna to be too much of product on your application brush. So guys, I'm gonna show you some placement techniques which you can easily use on the salon floor. So on my dolly head here, we had color her global color with Majoral 5.56. So starting off with the hairline, I'm gonna take a very, very thin diagonal slice. You can do it from the front, paint it like this. Or what I'm going to do is painting it on the surface. Please remember not too much of product onto the brush. So let's start. So I'm going to, very, very important is the angle what you hold and it has to be firm. Remember that you can't have it loose. Otherwise, you will not be able to paint the hair properly. There are different brushes you can use. You can use the angular brush or you can use the balayage painting brush also. You would see I hardly take any product onto my brush and I will start painting the hair just on the surface. Never start from the root area. Remember, you would always start from the mid. When you know there's hardly any product left, that's when you go closer to the roots. That's how you would never ever see strong lines and it will be beautifully blended. As I am going towards the ends, I can use my balayage board and really paint through the ends. Again, depends on how much do you want to show the color. You can either saturate the ends or you can gently brush through. I'm going to take my foil, place the product, and if I want, I can still saturate my ends and finally close my foil. So that's what you would do when you're trying to create face framing or you want to highlight the facial features of the consumer. So the next section, again, we are going to take a very deep diagonal section Take out a very thin slice 
Now, like I was saying, you can even tease it. I will not back comb it, but I would gently tease the hair so that it just adds more softness onto my hair. And I see even more blended color. Once again, I'm going to start from the mid, extremely gentle, going closer to the roots, okay? Very important one thing is that you will be using a circular motion, okay? I am not going straight. I am doing this, okay? I'm making a circle while I'm doing the application. When I know this, I have to come to the ends. I can bring in my balayage board. And finally, I would saturate my ends with Magi Contrast. You can use a cling wrap if you wish to. You can use the foil. In our salons, we all use foils, don't we? So from the back, what you can do, I'm taking first a horizontal section. Push this away from my, so that I can look at my section properly. And now you can either take a baby lights, like very, 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 very fine sections. You see? Have a look, it is extremely fine. You can even take a slice, tease it, but here I'm going to go slightly more thicker on my teasing because I don't want to see lines at all. I want to have the most finest blended placement technique. And I start painting it through from the mid lens Good amount of product I apply on the lens and ends. And when I know there's hardly any product on my brush, I go closer to the root. And now, if you want, you can place another foil on top or you can just close your foil in. So this is one way of doing it. The next one, I can go deep diagonal back. That means I am going to take a very big wheel. Okay, it's a very, very deep angle. Now, here, I will, what I will do, I will move with the shape of my head. This area, I will divide it into two sections. So, I take zigzag, that means I take a weave. This is going to be extremely visual. It completely depends on your client, the density of the hair and how much color your clients want to do. So what we can do is randomly pick up pieces So you see, I'm just randomly picking up pieces and I'm going to, again, paint it through very, very softly, going closer to the roots. The tension is very, very important, how you are holding up. So if you would do it open air, definitely it's going to be softer. If you enclose it in a foil, it's going to be slightly more vibrant. So it completely depends on you and your client. Again, I'm going to take a diagonal back slice, starting it from the middle of the section once again. But here I'm going to go vertical. So you see, I will start from here. So I'm going just on one angle. very, very gently painting it. When I know there's hardly anything, I go to the corner, very softly, I paint through, just at one point. And then, when I know I need to come to the ends, I bring in my foil, and work around the ends, saturating the ends completely. 
So we have seen three different ways or rather four different ways of doing some placements starting off from the front on what we did and then the back sections. It is completely personalized. It completely depends on you and your client how you would like to place the color on your consumer. So guys, like I had said, I will be showcasing few of the best looks from the Red Cherry collection. From the most subdued to the most bold one. So here we have our first model, Zoe. Zoe came to us yesterday with already previously colored hair. When we did her diagnosis, we saw she's got an oval face shape. As you all know, oval being the most ideal shape. For the diagnosis, we understood that she's got a natural skin tone. Again, a beautiful way to play around with hair color. Because she had previously colored hair, but not that dark, what we did for her, we worked around with the highlight technique, which is baby lights. I'm going to sketch it for you so that you can make a proper note of that. So here we have the most ideal face shape, which is the oval face shape. Baby lights are the most finest type of weaves you can do. It is not a slice, but there are very, very paper fine weaves what you need to put in onto the hair. So again, we will divide the head into four sections, the classic four from the back. What we did is taking diagonal back, very, very fine, working around the head. Okay, so we did working completely around the shape of the head and putting in. Now it completely depends again on the density of the hair and how's the hair flowing through. What we did for her, our diagonal back. But if you still want, you can even go diagonal forward. Diagonal back means V, diagonal forward means A. So here, you can even put in extremely fine placement with your baby lights. So ya aap A bana sakte hain, ya aap V bana sakte hain, depend karta hai shape ke upar, depend karta hai density ke upar and haircut ke upar. Again, sides ke liye bhi, jo hum logo ne kiya is working around with diagonal back, very, very fine weaves, calling it as baby lights. Right? Ek cheez yaad rakhega, when you are doing baby lights, don't go very, very close to the roots. Roots ko thoda sa dark rakhenge, thoda sa shadowing karenge, to wo jada better reta hai. So try to keep the roots slightly darker and then bring out your baby light techniques. Like I said, your styling is going to get much, much more edgier. In your Technia toolbox, I have some great, interesting products for you. So let me introduce you to the first product, which is the Techniart Plea. Techniart Plea is the must-have product in your toolbox. This is the most ideal product to base any type of blow dry or iron which you are going to do. It comes in a spray form. You shampoo the hair, towel dry the hair and spray in Plea. It has heat protection and the whole factor is four. We all love ring light, don't we? I introduce you with ring light from Techniart to add that shine, the mirror-like glaze on the hair. What you need to do is again, it's a beautiful spray. So let me show you how this product works. Here, my model has already, we have styled her hair. To finish her hair, I am just gonna add beautiful shine using the ring light. And voila, there you go. So guys, my next model here is Archana. Archana came to us yesterday again with previously colored hair on a base of five. When we did her diagnosis, we saw 
she's got more of a rectangular face shape. With further diagnosis, we analyze that she's got a warm skin tone. That's why warm reds will be the best for her. So the color we chose is from Inova family, which is 5.56 and Magic Contrast Red for the placement techniques. The placement technique, what we worked around, a full head of macro weaves. Also, we added some money pieces around her face just to highlight her facial features, to open up her face and to definitely highlight her cheekbones. So for Archana, we have done a global head of macro weaves. What are these weaves? I'm going to show you on the flip chart. For Archana, like I said, we had done the micro weaves for her. So what will you do? You divide the head first into your classic four sections. Taking it from the back, taking diagonal back and a very, very deep diagonal back sections. What we did, we created deep V's. Okay, so you take very, very deep macro weaves and you place them in the foil. If you want, you can even do open air technique. That is not a problem. But remember not to go very, very chunky. Depending on the density of the hair, you will be putting in your weaves. Taking the triangles across the head, it will break through and this technique will be very, very good if you have thick hair because this will break the darkness or the depth of the hair. Along with that, you can also work with brick technique if you want to. That means if you look at, you start off with smaller, you go larger as the head is going rounder and you close up again with the smaller weaves. So again, from the side, you again will take diagonal back. But here remember, we did some face contouring. That means we added some money pieces. When you're adding money pieces, remember, you need to go definition. You need to go more finer because you want to highlight the face. That's the reason we will start off with softer money pieces in the hair and then you can go even more bolder depending again on the density of the hair. So once again, the product what we use to prep Archana's hair is plea before the blow dry and then I introduce you to all new product, which is Savage Panache. Savage Panache, which is a texturizing spray to add glamorous movement into the hair. Again, it comes in a spray form. So you see a beautiful movement, lot of texture flowing through her hair now. And it's non-sticky. It's non-greasy and I can put my fingers through also. So that's the Savage Panache. So Vaishnavi, our beautiful model over here, she came to us with a lot of color yesterday. Rather, she had very light ends. So we had to do a technical service where we had to pre-color her hair dark and then add in this beautiful color what you see today on her. Vaishnavi has got, if you see very closely, a round face shape. So as you know, round, what do we have to do when we have to contour? We have to keep the hairline dark. That's what we did. Keeping in the hairline dark, the color placement was again working with the shape of her hair and the shape of the haircut what she has done. Because she's got a cooler skin tone, the shade palette what we have used for her is Majoral 6.62 and for highlights we have used Magic Contrast Magenta Red. Yeah, so again guys, I will be showing you what are the techniques we have used for her on the flip chart. So Vaishnavi, like you saw, has got round face. So for round face, first of all, what we did, 
is again created a small diamond on the top of the head. Now, very, very important thing to remember because you've got a round face, what you need to do is contour. That means you need to keep around the face darker. So, whatever you will do around the hairline will always be dark. Always remember this. Now what we did is, so if I look it from here is your diamond, here is your diamond. We took diagonal back sections from the front giving it a weave and one slice, one weave and one slice. From the back, Instead of going diagonal back, we went horizontal. So again, a weave and a slice, a weave and a slice, a weave and a slice. Same goes to the other side also. Like I said, always you need to personalize the shade or the technique what you are doing. You can either tease, back comb, depending on the density of the hair. So once again, become my favorite. I'm going to use the ring light to add in a beautiful shine onto her hair. So again, remember, this is a finishing product. What you need to do is after your styling has been done, just spray in to add that beautiful shine gloss in the hair and the movement, you see it all. So there you go. So when Bhakti came to us, I knew it. She was the one which can carry the most boldest look for us. She being the ideal client because she said, I have applied henna. Uh, yeah, she did. She applied henna four to five months back. But you can see, reds can also work on your henna clients. Definitely Bhakti has got an oval face shape. Once again, the most ideal face shape. We wanted to highlight all her facial features. So that's the reason we used Magi Rouge 5.20 and we have used Magi Contrast Red to add in beautiful highlights. Like you see, we have done a beautiful face contouring once again for her, adding lots of money pieces around her face so that we can highlight her cheekbones, we can highlight her jawline because she had the most ideal oval face shape. Very, very important guys is how will you take care of her hair while you are doing a hair color. That is your post color. Don't forget that after you have shampooed the hair, you have to use power mix. And which one? Vitamino color power mix to protect the hair color and make it longer lasting. She has a neutral skin tone. That is the reason we chose a 5.20 from Magi Rouge and Magi Contrast Red to put in highlights for her hair. What we have done, because she's got some beautiful eyes, Look at her cheekbones. We wanted to accentuate them. That is the reason we've added some money pieces in her hair to accentuate her eyes, her cheekbones and put in diagonal forward highlights on her. What are these highlight techniques or the placement techniques? I'm going to once again show you on the flip chart. So for Bhakti, because she's got an oval face shape, again, an ideal face shape, we wanted to bring out everything possible on her face. We wanted to highlight her eyes, her cheekbones, and we wanted to bring out a deep plum, a beautiful iridescent shade on her head. So what we did here, we will divide the head into classic four, taking it from the back, A. That means diagonal forward. Diagonal forward slices going through, 
back combed or teased a little bit because we don't want to see any harsh lines guys please remember aajkal harsh lines bahut zyada strong lines dekhne ka fashion khatam ho chuka hai so whenever you are taking any kind of a weave or a slice thoda sa usko tease kar do ya back comb kar do from the front again we worked around with a that means taking diagonal forward sections if you remember i had said we had put in beautiful money pieces so for her money piece what we did around her hairline we added some really really soft money pieces around so that's what you can do if you even have an oval face shape to create lot of dimensional uh, effects lot of lightness and darkness like a hide and seek playing through but don't forget money pieces to accentuate her facial features you definitely need to apply a post color treatment you know what i'm talking about the power mix and which power mix we will be using power mix vitamino color what will it do it will help to protect this beautiful color what we have done give shine protect the hair from uv rays and definitely longer lasting color aditi our glam doll when she came into us yesterday she had virgin hair dream for every single colorist but she was all ready to go bold that's the reason we chose these kind of palettes of shades for her when we did the diagnosis for her we saw she's got a square face we have to contour that means we need to add darkness around her face that's the reason we added darker panels around her face her forehead or her cheekbones and added lightness around her cheeks so the shade palette what we have used because she's got a warm skin tone we have used a 5.6 from majorel and magic contrast magenta red to add in the placement so for the placement technique what we have done we have done a vertical and horizontal weaves around her head taking in and what was the technique i'm definitely going to show you on the flip chart so aditi who's got a square face what are we going to do with her color technique remember first we will create a diamond section on the top of the head so that is the top of the head if you look at from the back the section is going to be like the diamond coming in the back section we are going to divide into two parts and start taking a diagonal back it's not a slice but we are going to weave it so here you are going to add in weaves into the hair so all around the back section we will be working on diagonal back weaves right taking deep diagonal back weaves what you can also do is slightly tease the hair i would not say calling it as back combing but you can slightly tease the hair if you look at from the side so you've got your diamond coming in you've got the diagonal back sections coming from here on the weave remember diagonal back is a v from the front section also you will be creating a deep diagonal back weaves so guys this is called as transformation when pratisha came to us do you want to see how she looked that's how she looked as soon as we saw her we knew it she is the one to carry a great hair cut with some beautiful placement of hair color definitely you can see a great bob which has been done her face shape was heart yeah or you can call it as triangular shape that's the reason we added some beautiful placement to accentuate again her cheekbones her skin tone is warm that's the reason we chose a mahogany shade for her you've used majorel 5.5 and magic contrast red for her 
if you look at the color placement again to add in a beautiful lightness around her face to open up her cheekbones we have added money pieces around plus if you see it is just naturally blended into her hair what is going to be the sectioning pattern for her i'm going to show you on my flip chart again so here as we have a heart shape or a reverse triangle if you want to call it as this is a slightly more complicated technique so i'm not going to do on the top of the head let's see from the back so from the back you divide the head into two parts one you take a diagonal forward section connected to the diagonal forward section you take a diagonal back section then again a diagonal forward section you take a diagonal back section you take a diagonal forward section so you're creating a zigzag onto the hair once again a diagonal forward connecting to a diagonal back connecting to a diagonal forward a diagonal back and a diagonal forward again in the front you can continue to do the same but for her what we did is classic diagonal back slices but definitely teased in so let me introduce you to the black beauty i have a product which is called as transformer from techniart adding transformation in the hair it's a multi use and multi dimensional product to add beautiful texture into the hair let me show you how does it work when i will squeeze out the product it will come as a mousse as i start emulsifying the product into my hair you would see the product changing into a gel and i can apply either the mousse or the gel on my model over here as soon as you see the texture changing what you have to do is just move into the hair and you would see transformation texture and movement even for men this can be the most appropriate product so you can definitely see a great movement texture you can call it as out of bed look or a runway look too we have many clients who walk into the salon with very very dark hair and when we want to do a color we get stuck what do we have to do we have to pre lighten the hair a product which you all know about is blonde studio multi technique 8 powder it can lighten the hair up to 8 levels without damaging the hair at all but as you know it's a 500 ml box we heard you you say that this is too big i have a great great news for you we launch a sachet for you now multi technique 8 sachet which will lighten the hair up to 8 levels chota packet bada dhamaka with the same properties same conditioning polymers to lighten the hair so guys don't forget to try out the new multi technique 8 sachet which is just 50 grams l'oreal professional has always taken the lead when it comes to beauty and technology together it goes without saying coloration service is powered by you our talented colorists and definitely it would benefit you you know what i'm talking about i am talking about the latest color technology the style my hair pro app it's available on your app stores so download it right now but please 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 do it after the class is over style my hair pro app or smh pro as we call it it is the most professional app for your salon floor to do the perfect hair consultation you can find on this app the products including the shade so you want to see how this app work let me show you so let's look at what are the latest trends let's look at if i go reds 
oh yeah i can go from the most versatile to the most bold uh from the warm to the cool oh uh, yeah let me take a picture don't leave the color results to the imagination of you and of your client show the client what the color result is finally going to be through this app undoubtedly for us you our hairdressers are the biggest champions we listen to you we take your feedback we have got products which are just for you so let's talk about the first concern the lack of interest she always says ha ha kara lungi abhi nahi karana i might get it done at a later stage but she is not interested right now please listen to her carefully give her your professional advice if she is not interested in getting bolder colors done you can think about soft sophisticated colors shade palettes like a 4.26 or a 4.20 which can be a very very muted color for her you can think about creating masterpieces for your clients by getting really soft highlights for them with a magic contrast red even with a 20 volume she will feel wonderful because you have heard her the second concern which definitely you must have heard all the time log kya kahenge mummy will like it or not whether this color is going to suit me or not so the best way is to do a proper client consultation do a hair color which is very very personalized and for that you are the expert how will you do it use the style my hair pro app you can personalize customize the entire hair color as per her skin tone as per her face shape so definitely log kuch nahi kahenge log yahi kahenge hair color acha lag raha hai and the biggest myth hair color karane se baal damage ho jate hain we as professional hairdressers hum sabko malum hai hair color karane se baal damage nahi hota but the only thing and the most important thing is how the client is taking care of her hair at home what kind of product is she using at home not to forget after the hair color has been done what is the treatment which you are using on your backwash so if you take proper care of the coloration post the coloration is been done on the salon floor and recommending the most appropriate hair care regime for her at home hair color karane se baal kabhi damage nahi hoga L'Oreal Professional is always looking for the next hairdresser superstar. Social media is the best platform to showcase. Today, we are going to show you some tips and tricks for you to showcase your talent. Tip number 1, like a good pair of scissors, you need to invest in a good salon equipment to shoot. Invest in a tripod, a ring light or even both. Tip number 2, it's all about lights 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 keep in mind to keep it fresh and clean tip number 3 adjust your phone camera settings shoot in 4k or hd settings tip number 4 square or rectangular always shoot on landscape mode for facebook switch to portrait mode if you're posting on instagram tip number 5 some do's always showcase your favorite product keep it cool keep it clean always keep space between every product make sure your products are always clean keep your videos short and sweet and finally some don'ts don't film on messy stations don't wear very flashy distracting clothes always remember there are 50 shades of black finally don't shoot your videos in poorly lit space so here we are guys showcasing the red cherry collection 2021 Don't forget to download Style My Hair app pro. Ask about the education boot camps for the Red Cherry. Showcase your masterpiece and don't forget to tag us. Tag Red Cherry and hashtag L'Oreal Prof India. For now, thank you so much.